still. Wait for it to pass. So these guys are called Watchers. Follow me across the trail to that tall grass. There's a big eyeball symbol on the top. I don't know oh, what that one. means. Let it pass. Oh, I see. That must be like visibility indicator. Where's the other? Oh, there it is. Good senses, Dad. Or I guess Rost. Like Aloy just calls him Rost. So okay. Come back this way. The slower you move, the quieter it will be. Hostile Which machine. Is quieter than upright. Okay. Ooh, did I get too close? I hope I didn't get too close. That's the last of it. Let's move on. Okay. Stealth perfected. You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now Stealth symbol close. shows how visible you ahead. are. Okay. So now I'm extra visible. There's like little notches there. Okay. I get it. Oh, she's so cute running around like that. Whoa! Who's that? Ignore him. But why is he up there? Dude, you know Aloy's like, I wanna do that. Sick parkour right there. Smiling at us. <laughs> of hey, course, look. Get back where you belong. <laughs> He's like, yeah, you see me, guys. These Ignore moves. Him. We are outcasts, and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. And he is a fool. That's interesting. Come now, let's find that herd. That's that's. This is a bigger mystery that I'm interested in than simply what happened to the world. Is why is he an outcast? Because he's like really respectful to the tribe, and he's like okay with it still. Yeah, he, he like seems to be like cool. That's those are striders, robot horses. Good, good, good. Like, like, why is he? What what happened to get him outcasted? Because like, there. see them. These are called striders. And they are friendly machines? It said so. Yeah. Why'd you chase them off? Huh. To show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Okie doke. Oh. I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Plenty of rocks right Good. here. That's it. Those there will we do. go. Follow. Hooray! How much sound you're making, okay? If I do this... Ah, very good. There is a run, which is, of course, shift. Oh, yeah, this one I'm playing on mouse and keyboard because eventually we're going to be aiming... Oh, there we go. Sprint. Eventually we're going to be aiming a bow and shooting stuff. And I would rather do that with a mouse and keyboard than with a controller. That's just how I roll. There's the herd. All right. It's time to throw some rocks. Oh, that was funny. She the almost fell over. Machines, right? No, but they can distract them. Draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Unless they are first silenced. Oh. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. What's the signal? Is it... Did he, did he give the signal? Can I? Aloy, throw a rock near me. That was a signal. Yeah. You like that? You robot raptor? Freaking dead. Good job. Or offline, I guess. Stay on the ridge. 
But I want to go and look at the dead robot. There. Come, girl, it's safe now. Okay. Ooh. Oh, man. I love this snowy mountain vibe. Such good stuff. Ah, dude, that was sick. We gotta have some ridge wood. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but maybe someday Harvest I'll have kills so I can teach you how to make arrows. Sick, I wanna do that. We get some metal shards and sparkers. Zap zap. Good. Now, gather stalks of ridgewood from the plants over there. Oh, way ahead of you. Already got one. And um, where is there some more? There. Lovely. I do wonder, like, how accessible the world will be. And metal shards for our heads. Once we're done with, um, you know, tutorial and it's time to open world. And what are those up there? What We saw those in the opening as well in the background. W what happened up there on those hills? I don't know. Anyway, Hunter Bow. Press and hold to... Quick craft. Oh, oh it says at the bottom there what you need. Um... Two sticks and one arrow. And I guess we're full. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, you make ten at a time. Cool. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. I guess it makes sense to use metal tips. So because those can hurt the machines. I guess that's the move. Yeah, the lore of this game, it's very high concept. And I... I guess I can understand if someone's like, I don't like... One of the weaker machines. This crazy concept. Uh... Press V and scan the Strider. Um, hostile Strider. Oh! Blaze Canister. That's probably where we can hit the thing, right? The canister on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed... Oh no, don't say that out loud. Plaything? Stop playing games. Oh no. Now, take down that Strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. Yeah, I can understand if someone's like, I don't get this crazy concept, freaking future with cave people and like robot machines. Why are the machines, uh, robot machines, ro robot animals? Why are the animals, why are the robots acting like animals? That's crazy. I'm all hey, for this kookiness. Take aim and make your kill. Okay. Keep firing! Woo! Yeah! First kill. Yeah, I'm all about this kind of crazy concept, so, like, sign me up. I don't care what the... What the, um... Like... What is the, like, excuse for this... Crazy world that these people live in. I'm all for it. have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy. Quick. Uh-oh, we gotta be heroes. Oh, th this damn robot horse is in the way. Is it even... A I, I think it kind of whinnied like a horse. I, I think that's what it's supposed to be like. I'm not sure what the watchers are. Are they just raptors? They have a raptor shape, so that's probably... I, I can't think of any animals currently alive that are shaped like that. So it's a kind of bird, kind of, but still. That tail, it's good. Those are, those are definite dinosaurs. Yo, this tribal beat. I dig it. Ooh, that's a, damn. Sick parkour didn't win out in the end, this poor guy. Oh my god, no! Oh yeah, no, those totally we need, those robots. That was some horse action, except... I 
don't think... Are they gonna attack him? That's very violent for horses. It's only a matter of time before the machines find that boy and kick him to death. Oh no! That's a horrible way to go. It will cause a stampede. They will trample him. But I can see the path they take. Stop telling stories. Oh my God! I'm Just... not. I can sneak through. You will not. No, oh, Rost is having a very bad day now. I totally get his, because, you know, now they're both in trouble, basically. Yeah, but, uh... Oh, boy. Really great character development, of course, or just, like, you know, showing the characterization, you know, just more of Aloy's headstrong nature here. I, I really like that. Oh! Ooh. I like track. Oh, oh, cool. I need to move slowly, quietly, so I can sneak past them. Let's pack the heck up. So I think I want to get to that bush right there once this fella is back on the return path. Looks like we can untag, untag it once we're in that bush ahead of us. Cool. Cool beans. What the? Oh gosh, what is visible? Let's grab some wood while we're here. Did I upset the thing? Bee! Well, that thing makes up circuit like that, so I gotta wait for it to. I think now it's safe. That arrow, that uh, that eye symbol at the top being all like you are visible is giving me some major agita. Oh no, I can't use the weapon wheel to make more weapons at the moment. I was hoping I could, but uh, no chance. Next guy. Okay, gotta cross the water, but uh, when is it safe? I have no clue. Maybe now. I need to see their paths. Yeah, I see his path. Quickly, quickly, quickly before he turns around. Oh my God! Almost there. Here's the problem, though. Now, making another return. Pass? I'm not gonna risk running here. I'm gonna let it take some distance from me. Yeah, I can't craft any arrows at the moment, so if I'm busted, I guess we're in trouble. But I guess the game is doing its, like, um, stealth tutorial at the moment, so... Now let's risk it. Adios. We don't know what the Watchers do when they're provoked, but I don't want to find out right now. Whoa, that's not a robot, that's a turkey. Gobble, gobble. Let's see. Turkey, run distraction for me. Hey, Teb. Oh my god, it's right there! Follow me. Oh good, his his legs work. Get the freaking bush! Freaking amazing, that's why. Okay. No, but this is a cool mechanic. Seeing guard roots, I mean, or, you know, enemy roots. I, I think that's pretty neat. Oh, now here we go. There's a bush between us. How are you doing this? Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're gonna let. Oh, maybe now it's safe. Come on, come on, come on. Quick, 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 quick. 
Now we're gonna let this fella circle right back. There you are, Teb. Good. Oh, those striders are right there. Hope they're not... They, they were a little antsy, though. You! Okay! Eh. <laughs> Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, uh oh. She saved me. I, I just wanted. Boy! Seal your lips. They are outcasts, both. And she is motherless. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. Ouch! Oh my goodness. Freaking. The boy should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. Contrast of parenting here. Rost is like awesome, and that dude. Ugh. Follow. I know the way. Aww. It, it sucks for Aloy, obviously. This isn't great. The, the situation they're stuck in, it isn't great, and it kind of sucks that Rost is so cool with it. He must have his reasons, but... Oh, and this sucks extra much! What the f... Stay away, no mother! Oh my... Oh, this douche, he's gonna be a bad guy later, oh. isn't he? He's so gonna be... Oh, shh! Oh my god! Flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Choose the freaking fist, and Aloy will confront the challenge directly. Choose brains, and Aloy will use her insight to find a clever, less obvious thing. Or choose heart to be a goody two-shoes. I think Aloy's a little feisty, but... um. Actually, I think, like, kid Aloy is probably a little more brash, so I... I think if I play the character, I think I will do... I did not know this is in the game. This is interesting, these kind of moral choice things. I, but I think Aloy at this point is kind of brash enough to be like this. Maybe I'll play her a little cooler when, once we get to, you know, grown-up Aloy. But let, let's, let's be shit kids for now. <laughs> okay. Okay, Aloy. I think... I made dad mad. And it's fair. That is a shitty thing to do, of course. But oh my god, so like... That guy is gonna be like some kind of rival douchebag character once we move to... Adult Aloy times, right? Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. <laughs> no, but that catching that rock. Aloy, I've told that you was before. crazy. That's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? <sighs> it's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Hot dog. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proven. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard. And it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Oh, that's adorable. Yeah, yeah. 
do we cut to? Oh, okay, we get a montage. Awesome. Yeah, she's got the parkour too. Oh, this is some <laughs> risky training, you know. You know, for a little six year old, I don't know. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah. Good thing Papa's got her back. And also, so cool that Rost is still, like, pretty chill with that um, scanner Dorito. Aww. Like, he's a, he's a pretty decent father figure, isn't he? Pretty happy with him so far. Oh my god. Oh my god! That, that, that shot of how high up that tree is. Look, I just don't like seeing kids in peril, okay? <laughs> this is really perilous. Oh my wow! Sick. Sick transition into adult Aloy. Can you do sliding attacks with the bow in the game? I'm gonna be so in love if that's a thing you can do in the game. Oh, that's so cool. He was ready to step in, but he was like, nah, you got this. Oh, man. We turned into Ashley Birch. Yay! Rost? 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 Where is he? Two days before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that. Yay, we leveled up. Years of trading, only to get three levels. Okay, I think we'll end the episode here as we check out unlock skills. What? Hold on, what symbol? Was that enter? That's an interesting button to get the map. Ooh! Alright then. I don't have. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. I don't have proper appreciation for how huge all this is yet, but um, it's. Um, yeah, ooh, ooh. Scrapper sight, Strider sight. Scrappers, Striders. Mother's heart. Yaha. Uh -huh. Mother's Watch, Mother's Cradle. Whole lot of mamas here. The the place we were in earlier was Mother Something as well, but I, I forget which one. Probably over here, maybe this valley over here? Oh, looks like it. Cool. A Karja Hunter Bow. This lightweight bow trades power for faster reload and firing time and is good for short to medium range combat. Fire arrows can ignite blaze canisters and backpacks. Can be modified. Oh, <laughs> that's that's a little grim. I like it. No outfits. No. Okay, potions, resist potions, traps. Uh -huh. Carry capacity. Um, okay. Ammo. Fire arrows, hunter arrows. We need some blaze. We need to blaze it up for fire arrows. To deals low fire damage over time and medium fire severity on impact. Use this arrow to set machines on fire. Useful against machines with blaze canisters or fire vulnerability. We'll keep it in mind. Travel. Fast travel pack. This item provides fast travel to a single discovered campfire or settlement throughout the world. Oh, interesting. So fast travel isn't free. Uh-huh. Ooh. Machine catalog. 
Yeah, do we have trivia? Compact, inquisitive, and agile recon unit that will attempt to swarm a target in numbers. Uh -huh. You want to hit them in the eye. Uh -huh. Makes sense. They drop metal charge sparkers for shock ammunition. Uh -huh. And wires. Very good. And here's that strider. Herd machines that will bolt when disturbed, so they must be dealt with silently or quickly. Is not mountable yet. Yet. Okay, hit that blaze canister. And you can get blaze from them, but you probably have to not blow up the canister to get it. So, we'll keep that in mind. For oh, heaven's sake! Look at this list of stuff. That's a lot of enemies to deal with. Well, actually, yeah, now that I look at it, like, look at all this. Boom. There's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 13, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31 enemies. Are these bosses? Because they're all... They have this blue pattern here. They don't look intimidating. And we got a bunch of data points. Very good, very good, very good. Oh my goodness, lots of stuff to find. We're already 2% done with the game, and we've only recorded a couple of episodes, so that means it's going to be 100 episodes. Nah, <laughs> well, if we were going to 100%, but we're not. So what do we have here? We have a spear and a bow. So can I not equip the... Do I not have a spear? Okay, we have our outfits. The outcast outfit. Looks cool. Mods, resources, treasure boxes. Okay, special items. What a trader token. Get bonus items. Aha, this is some kind of PC port buyer bonus thing. Harvest this from the scrapper. Okay, quest item. Huh, okay. Got um, good stuff. Okay, cool. Now let's go to skills. Aha! Uh -huh. Prowler, Brave, Forager, Traveler. Aha! Uh -huh. So these probably are stealth stuff, these are probably combat stuff, and these are sneaky sneak stuff. I believe I've made my stance clear in the past that I am rather famously, I kind of tend to always go a little bit of everything rather than commit to one track, so. I think that's what we're going to be doing here as well. So, what do we have available? Prowler, Silent Strike. Uh-huh. So that's your stealth attack. Take down. Ooh, tough choice here. Which one do I want? Oh, these are all fantastic. Which one do I pick? Probably going to take this. Oh, there's cost mentioned. Okay, these are all a cost one, so let's... Thank you. Brave. While aiming, toggle that to slow down time. Yaho. Press for a high damage attack on downed enemies. Uh-huh. And precision. Light spear attacks have an increased chance to knock off armor and components. Mm-hmm. I think I'll go for the slow down while aiming, although... I wish there was a toggle where this just automatically goes on when you're aiming, like... The fact that you have to toggle it is a little tricky, but... Okay. Lure call. Use this from the tool menu to lure a single enemy to your position. The target will be the closest, most centered in Alloy's view. I guess I said Alloy again, it's Aloy. I'm an idiot. That would work nicely with Prowler. Lure them over and uh, boing boing them when they get close. Speeds up healing from the medicine pouch. Additional natural resources when foraging. That's a lame skill, but a useful one. I guess I'll take that. This track here is interesting, but yeah. Okay, uh, I believe we are done for now for today. Didn't quite get to run around as actual Aloy. We were kid Aloy for these first couple of episodes, but um. All good. Ooh, isn't that nice? They immediately show you that you've got a ways to go to this next point. Just to add a little bit of freedom to our coming adventures. Fun! I'm into it. And I'm into this game so far. 
it it of course it was a very narrow tutorial thing we did today you didn't have a jump into uh the open world adventure memorizing yet but i'm sure that's coming in the in the future but as a um laying out the premise and the story and the characters this has been fantastic so far i'm excited to see what we're gonna be doing in this crazy ass world that we find ourselves in i hope you guys look forward to it as well so next time we get on with the actual story sound good yeah catch you all then everybody bye, -bye. <laughs>